What's going on everyone? Welcome to an Outdoor Outdoors video. I'm here with Uncle Josh at this newly found mushroom spot. And this is just a sneak peek of what's to come. This big tree covered in birch polypore is what we think it is. So there's a lot of mushrooms that we found in this video. We hope you enjoy this and see what we found. I'm gonna make a jump for it. <laughs> That's that part's bark. Oh, I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I don't. Should I touch it? I don't think that's, I don't know if that's bark or not. It's not gonna hurt you, but I don't know what that is. I'm, I'm too scared to check it. Hmm. Okay. There's a chance that that could be brittle cinder fungus growing over there. This is the north side of here ahead. The opposite side is where they're probably growing better, but that's a little too far of a hike for today. I don't know what these are. Growing on the moss. That's the first time I've seen them get syrup like that. Uh -huh. Get zoomed in here. It looks, I don't know, it kind of looks more lighter green than the ones we found before. There's some over there too. It looks plentiful. Let's look at a way we can get back out if we get down there. You think we can just climb back up this? Or Maybe to the right. I'd say right over here. Yeah. I think we'll be okay. Now I have hiking boots on, so I'm, I'm okay. This is going down. These leaves, that's the problem. The leaves are yeah. slippery. Just dig your heels in like on the side. There we go. There's a lot of them. That's last year's. They're too dead. Still cold, but that's last year's. Okay. There's black ones on there too. These are old ones. snail shell or something. Wow. Right by this tree. All the way up here. Is there something in there? I don't think so. I think that's an empty one. Yeah. You want to keep it? Why not? You can keep it if you want. A nice cluster of mushrooms that we think is chaga. It looks just like it. It, it. it has to be. Look at that. It's so cool. We can't reach it. It's a big drop. That looks like last year's. They're big. Why does it look like dried up sheep head? This would be perfect. We can get up close to them too. There's some close to the ground. Like by the 
edge. Really good down to it. We have some good spots you can find them. That might be a massive thing to chop on. I think that is a massive clump. Because that well, the, there's white mushrooms growing on that tree, and right here, that that's a big thing of chaga. I'm pretty sure. That doesn't look like the tree. Wow. We're climbing up this hill here. Let's see if we can get to those chaga mushrooms and see what the other white ones are. Here's a close up. But we thought were the chaga mushrooms, but I'm not sure. Now well, that, if I can get a good angle, that is a nice mushroom girl. Oh, this video does not do it justice. Huh. Yeah, I can bring an axe one time or something. Oh, look, we can see them good now. All in this hollow ground. Wow. We found it. We gotta get up there. That might be the sheep head. We gotta get up there. That's gonna be hard, but there's a lot of branches to grab. Like roots. This tree here. These all, all these roots you could use to grab on, unless you think it's easier over there. Either way. Or, right here is not too bad. This is pretty steep. Dude. I wonder, I wonder if it'd be slippery. Cause there's a foothold here. There we go. Grab onto this uh, vine or those things like that. Yep. yep. It's not too steady, stable there. Sturdy. I think we found what we're looking for. Yep, that's it. That's it. This is amazing. It's like it was it was like it was like it was meant to be found. There was light shining on it. There you go. Well, let's do it. Little black mushrooms here. <laughs> These are fresh. These are this year. They're not. They're not dried out. Oh, there's a huge one. I think that's an oyster. Oyster mushroom. Look. Oh my gosh. These are this year. These are fresh. Here we go. You're right. I need to watch where I step. They are literally everywhere. <laughs> there it is. Look at this. Finally. Nice. Because if they are, we got, look at that the whole way up, man. Yeah, and Uncle Josh did some looking. <laughs> and he found out that it is called birch polypore, is at least what it seems like to us. And it looks just like them, so it has to be. Is there more? Look. Oh, look at that. Wow, and there's a big one right on that left tree too, right beside us. Nice. This is it. This is the mushroom haven. They're everywhere. I wonder if we can find morels here. Because even if, even if they're not ready yet, because a lot of these are old, look at how much they're growing on these. They're, they're everywhere. Every tree has mushrooms. This is where we come in a couple weeks. This is great. Even over here on the stump. There's little green mushrooms growing on it. That's so cool. Wow. That's a big mushroom. That's a big mushroom, dude. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, the polypores are ones that are like this. The polypores are usually shelf ones. Um. Wow. 
while. A couple more weeks, man. I think we'll be in we'll be in good shape, but like I would think like depending on what time, every week or every other week. Yeah. We'll have to pick some time and do this. I'm fine with that. Thanks for watching this video. We hope you enjoyed. We found a ton of different kinds of mushrooms today. And this is something we're going to start doing a lot now, especially here in PA. A lot of people have been finding morels and we saw the mushrooms that we found. So they're definitely starting to grow. So thanks for watching. We hope you enjoy. We'll see you next time.